Hello chatties, welcome to Chatty Portal. So this video is made for those who are asking kung papaano pa po makasali sa PISO game ngayon. Dahil medyo meron ng changes from my last uploaded video on how to join the PISO game using Shopee Coins. So ngayon kasi may kaibahan na siya. Like, I'll give you an example. Punta kayo sa PISO game. Then, pay now. So, ito, pag i-add to cart nyo yan, I think it's already in my cart na. Yan, naka-add to cart na ako. For example, ito, before, pag clinic mo yung redeem Shopee coins dyan, zero na yan. Tapos, pag i-check out mo yan sa payment option, before, makikita mo yung COD. While ngayon, hindi mo na siya makikita. Yung available na lang talaga is credit or debit card. And then, and then, Shopee Pay. However, sa Shopee Pay, kailangan mo siyang i-activate. So, yeah, pag wala kang payment method, hindi mo talaga siya ma-place order. Kaya, hindi na talaga makakasali using Shopee Coins lang ngayon. Now, how do you activate your Shopee Pay? Punta kayo dito sa Me tab. And then, from here, you'll see Shopee Pay. Then, set up Shopee Pay. Kaya lang, hindi, hindi naman talaga ako magsiset up ngayon. So, punta kayo dito sa Read More. And then, click nyo yung Set Up Shopee Pay Instructions. So, dito, malalaman nyo yung way to set up your Shopee Pay. So, first step is just like what we did Go to the Me tab. Ito siya. And then, select Shopee Pay. Tapos, third part is yung setup. And then, dito, kailangan mong i-input yung name, email address, and then, check the terms and conditions kung nabasa mo na. Tapos, i-click-click mo yung next. After clicking next, uh, you have to... Enter the one-time password OTP sent to your phone. So, pag click mo ng next, magsisend si Shopee sa phone number mo, yung registered with your Shopee account, ng OTP. So, halimbawa yan, 00T3, and so, example yan ng OTP. So, kailangan mo siyang i-enter dyan sa change Shopee pay pin. And then, dito na, you have to nominate your own Shopee Pay pin that you will be able to remember. So, six digits. And then, confirm mo lang to make sure na na natandaan mo talaga yung, yung Shopee Pay pin. And then, for the eighth part, you can now start using Shopee Pay. So, yan. So, pwede mo na siyang gamitan dito. Pero, pag i-verify mo yung Shopee account mo, Shopee Pay account mo, you get more benefits. So, increase maximum balance to 100,000 pesos and then free of charge for withdrawals from Shopee Pay to your bank account. Kung gusto mong i-verify talaga yung Shopee Pay account mo, eto naman yung kanyang uh, steps. So, first is you have to go to settings. Yan, yung settings icon. Yung gear icon. And then, select ID verification sa Shopee Pay settings. This is kung meron ka ng Shopee Pay, ah. And then, you have to still input the required information. Dito naman, hihingin na sa'yo yung place of birth mo at saka date of birth. At, you have to take a photo of your government-issued ID and take a self-portrait with the same ID. 
So actually, yung process niya, para siyang GCash, pag nagpapa-full verify ka ng iyong GCash um, ID or account, ganito din. Kailangan mong mag- mag-take ng photo ng iyong government-issued ID. Tapos, after that, if you verify ni Shopee, and then your account is good na and fully verified. Then, additional information naman, para dun sa mga nagtatanong kung paano naman mag, ma, makakapag-load sa iyong Shopee Pay or magkakaroon ng balance ang iyong Shopee Pay. So, dito naman tayo sa how to use Shopee Pay. Dito ka. Uh, punta ka lang sa how do I top up my Shopee Pay. So, ito yung paano ka makakapaglagay ng pera or balance sa iyong account. Magkaroon ng balance sa iyong account. So, you have to follow these steps to top up your Shopee Pay. Merong tatlong pagpipilian, top up, withdrawal, and transactions. You need to tap on top up. Tapos, dito, yung parang sa ATM, di ba? Mamimili ka kung alin sa mga denominations yung gusto mong i-load sa iyong account. Now, um, if wala dyan, pwede mo namang i-input yung amount dito sa baba. And then, nag-show na siya dito sa total payment. Now, you have to pay your top-up via remittance or payment center, over-the-counter, or online payment. For remittance or payment center, pwede kayong magbayad sa Robinson's Department Store or sa 7-Eleven. Click yung machine sa 7-Eleven. Doon din ako naglo-load ng GCash sa 7-Eleven. And then, meron naman silang over-the-counter options. So, the following banks naman. Kaya lang, uh, I think sa over-the-counter kasi parang hassle siya dahil meron kang babayaran na 50 pesos fee on top of your Shopee payment. So, parang um, hindi siya sulat for me kung ito yung magiging option mo. But anyway, uh, you, will be you will be directed to a page with payment instructions. So, yung Dragon Pay na after processing your payment, you proceed, will enter to your Yan. So, nakikita nyo, Dragon Pay, payment instructions, tapos merong 50 peso service fee added to the original amount. So, meron silang note that top-up methods may be changed by Shopee Pay at any time without prior notice. So, yun. Yun yung way kung paano kayo makakapag-load sa inyong Shopee Pay. And then, how do you pay naman with Shopee Pay, ito yung steps niya. So, halimbawa sa Piso Game, pag na-verify na yung Shopee Pay account mo, lalabas na siya sa payment option. So, click mo lang yung Shopee Pay and then you're good to go. Makakasali ka na sa Piso Game. Nakakasad lang na hindi na pwede yung coins kasi before pwede naman. Kahit na hindi ako nananalo, nag enjoy din naman ako sa pagsali-sali dun sa Piso Game. And then, tap Shopee Pay as the payment method and check out. So, yan. So, yung purchase that will be deducted from your Shopee Pay balance immediately. Now, from what I know, sa Piso game kasi, i-deduct nila, but then, after the game, isa sa uli naman, um, i-refund -re naman din, fund din naman nila yung Piso pag hindi ka isa sa mga winners. Tapos, dito naman, yung iba pang mga ano, questions nyo, how to withdraw from Shopee Pay, tapos meron pa dito how to change your PIN. So, basta sa withdrawal naman, halimbawa, meron kang nailagay na malaking amount pero gusto mong i-withdraw, you must have an added verified account before withdrawing. And then, to withdraw from Shopee Pay, you can click here to know how to add a bank. So, yung mga list of verified banks nila ay ito. Yung mga nakikita nyo dyan. And then, this might change without prior notice. So, yan. So, once we click it here, 
clean na. Super nagloading na siya, guys. So, yun lang naman, guys, for the how to join Piso game using Shopee Pay. Kasi, alam ko, sa previous video ko, um, nasabi ko na you can join using coins. Kasi, before talaga, pwede ka talagang sumali na coins lang yung gamit mo. Kaya lang, ngayon, nag-iba na ng mechanics si Shopee. do binasa ko dito sa current mechanics nila, yung sabi dito is pwede pang gumamit ng Shopee coins. Kaya lang, trinay ko, ayaw niya talagang mag-go through without a payment method. E, wala ng COD. Kaya, you really need to register either sa Shopee Pay or your debit or credit card account. Now, anyway, that's all for this tutorial and see you on our next Shopee tutorial. Bye!